Saturday, February 10th. Heads up on the, the sun, spaceweather.com. Recommend everybody go see it, read it. Go to the archive here and check out the 9th. Also, yesterday's Friday information also about the protons raining down on Earth. There's a lot of information here of data. So, Lord, look at that. We're going through a solar radiation storm, people. Uh, what's a solar radiation storm? In other words, we're being microwaved in a sense. We're hitting hit. We're being hit with radiation, protons, you name it. Right here, they say 25% chance for S-class flare. This sunspot right here, 3576. Click on that. Ay, ay, ay. Um, 3576. This is current. Current. So all those particles is hitting the spacecraft Soho, just parked in front of the Earth, and it's all those particles are hitting the lens. It's it's hitting Earth, and there's more information here. A lot of read, a lot of links. Now this this here is for radio blackout. Where the red's at, shortwave radio blackouts. Anything under 30 hertz, megahertz. Let's take a look at the five. Okay, five. Anything red. More. There's more information here about the X-ray flux and everything. You go to the homepage on NOAA Space Web other government and it has a lot more information here also why is this important for so many reasons i mean right now that sunspot what was it 35 76 take a look now looking at this uh magnetic field magnetosphere you see you would think it'd be all red right and with the schumann resonance high but schumann resonance of frequency just penetrates but if an X-class flare was to hit a direct shot at us, all this would be red, the highest scale. And here's more. Our shields, you can see waves of a, a, a reconnect right here. Now, taking a look real quick at the Schumann residence off the chart. But this was a while back. Right now, currently, it's kind of like subsided. But there was two blasts, from one from the 8th and the 9th. I mean, it's just been blasting. But this one was big. This was yesterday. Now, we got activity in the sun. All these are recent we had that m class on the left side of the sun missed us now here's some information about 3576 is also directly facing earth over the next three to four days if an x class occurs in this area it could pose a danger to earth absolutely i've done videos on that what our m class we had an m class um direct hit and we had auroras all the way down to florida did a video on that but heads up heads up people are gonna start losing their minds also too what's happening with this uh with the schumann resident let me play a little bit okay stefan put a video five days ago it influences our biology our cellular voltage break trigger larger changes in charge in our bodies so this is very very relevant and what we're seeing is a huge resonance amplification in our background electromagnetic field. A gamma ray, for example, or an X-ray, will quickly interact with some, um, you know, some ion or matter. It will quickly get absorbed into that. You know, that photon will get absorbed by an electron. These wavelengths of light overlap with our brain waves in that. Field. Like you said, it will affect the heart rhythm. Anybody with pacemakers heads up like i said solution is pray it affects the water it changes the water molecules it heals healing properties jesus taught us all this let's continue it alters our experience of reality because while we have our own internal systems we have the ability to change those systems based on our consciousness these could be a collective consciousness field because they align it in a way that is possibly at like extinction level event or scale took him a while e exactly now he has a link right here let's go down here let's check out the latest right here this was how many hours ago one two three 14 hours ago for this data it went all the way to the bottom 40 yeah all the way down the chart who knows how far down more it went in other words the whole planet right to the core and this is a frequency that's not affecting like i showed earlier it lasted for 12 hours then it had a little pause then it came back and it lasted again for five hours then we had a spike right here so this is energy coming from who knows it's probably the x class or like i say the center of the universe or the galactic center or divine i'm uh, i'm in the in the camp of divine 
divine light, divine, the force of good, the force of one, sending us a message, uh, affecting the, you're noticing a lot of the bad people are being affected the most. They're being exposed. Things are happening all over the planet. And like a early, it's like a warning system. Early warning system is uh, Jesus coming back soon. Head of, head the, before the eclipse. Sure. Something is giving us a warning. So, so he has more links here. Keep our eye. Let's keep our eye on that sunspot that's facing us right now. They're saying that 25% and our shields are like what? 50%, 60%. And if we get a direct hit, it's going to affect, going to affect a lot of things, people, a lot of thing my advice is pray get that shield that aura that protection and the only way to activate that is through prayers i said over and over our planet's mostly water you need all the protection you can get because this is going to affect a lot of people it's already having a lot of effect on people's sleep people complaining with headaches people can't are just getting sicker that thing that uh, is growing there's so much here that I'm going to have to come back and do another video. This is stereo. Let's take a look at stereo's latest. I love stereo. You know, the spacecraft. Let's zoom it in. Okay, this is stereo. Let's look. Okay, that's the M class. Look at that. My goodness gracious. And this is just an M class, folks. And this was not Earth directed. Now, this one here, what we're seeing now, that might have been Earth directed. Okay, that's the current image right now. Right now, it seems like there's nothing. And that's the time right there 1152 Eastern Standard Time. This right here. So, right now we're in the eye of the storm bombarding not only on the schumann resident also in the sun and the solar system i mean evil is out of control and we're being sent some uh, energy accept it but you gotta realize it for what it is once you realize for what it is then you pray pray who knows we could have three days of darkness all the prophecies fatima you name it so many prophecies hopis the red book of revelation enoch i mean from a to z and then the signs and the stars that i'm covering i focus on one pacific thing which is the comet it's our messengers harbingers omen throughout ancient history destroyers of prior civilization grandpa is here and he's just giving you a heads up if you don't trust me and the others are out there you know uh with the shafar blowing the horn trust your sixth sense trust your feelings trust your your stuff your inner voice your angels are telling you trust them listen to them talk to them and they'll you'll get your answer so heads up red alert everybody chills up uh, who knows what's coming in the next uh what 72 hours next three four days this is a heads up bless everything you eat also okay hope that helps i hope that one piece of the puzzle helps and i'm just gonna keep on until next time give me a thumbs up if you like this content if you want to live right now it's not about the money all this is all this is information that i'm relaying i could be local cuckoo or i could be close to the target either or L seeing is believing feeling is believing open your eyes and you will see until next time bye